At council meeting, uh, myself and the consultant, we will present a broad overview of the code. At 600 pages, we're not going to go into all of the details, but we'll give highlights of the changes. And at that point in time, City Council will ask questions and then open it up for the public. So at that point in time, the public can come and offer their input into the code. It will shape our development patterns. So how you experience the city as you drive and walk through will be impacted by development regulations. Whether you see trees, whether you have parking for your bicycle, when you go to a, to a commercial development. Those are all things that are regulated through this ordinance. So the shape, the actual form of the city will be impacted by these regulations. We needed to rewrite the zoning ordinance because the development patterns that we now value and want to encourage were not made accessible by the old code. Uh, the development type that was going on in the 1970s was largely suburban. Um, everybody wanted to get in their car and drive from place to place. What we hear from our citizens a lot now is they want a more walkable community, they want a mix of uses so that they don't have to get in their car and go everywhere. And it's important for people to know is that our residential districts are largely staying the same. Um, those have proven to, to work fairly well. Um, we are allowing for some flexibility with setbacks and those kinds of things, but the residential areas are near the commercial, so they will be impacted by that. Sign up for updates, because this is the first step in a two-step process. We adopt the actual text of the code, which is the zoning ordinance, but then we have to redraw the zoning maps to reflect those new zoning districts. So that will be ongoing in the next year. We will be having public meetings to get input about where those zoning districts are applied. So it's important if people want to be involved and we want them to be involved for them to sign up for those updates. They can also uh, submit comments. The project website is at www.weplantogether.org and there's a link to be able to submit comments. There you can also call the zoning office as well at 803-545-3333.